published 1200 est the 5th of november 2017 updated 1206 est the 5th of november 2017 russell brand pictured will switch on the christmas lights in marlow buckinghamshire residents in a town dubbed millionaires row because of the number of mansions are furious because left-wing comedian russell brand will switch on their christmas lights it was revealed the 42-year-old would be turning on the lights in the affluent buckinghamshire town but the announcement has not gone down well with locals Alistair Gibbs said he is disgusted at the plan for Mr. Brand to perform the annual ceremony on November 23rd and will not go to the event for the first time in 11 years. He said the big switch on the biggest switch off more like Mr. Brand, from Grey's S, will follow in the footsteps of former Bake Off presenter Mary Berry, 82, who switched on the lights last year. In 2015, Olympic rowing hero and Marlowe-born Sir Steve Redgrave did the honours but Mr. Brand's involvement has sparked outrage. Residents living in the affluent town, where detached properties sold for an average of more than £1 million last year, have criticised the council. One local resident said he and his family will be avoiding the event for the first time in 11 years in protest. Mr. Gibbs said Marlow Town Council must have suffered a collective memory failure when choosing Alice comedian Russell Brand as this year's celebrity guest. With self-confessed addictions to drugs and HES hardly a role model for the young. The big switch on the biggest switch off more like residents living in the affluent town pictured where detached properties sold for an average of more than £1 million last year have criticised the council Dilgray said thank god I don't live in Marlow I would think with him switching the lights on would be enough to cancel Christmas. Sorry but I really cannot stand him at any price. Social media user Marcus62 wrote on a local social media page HE's an offensive little man who thinks he can bully people because HE's famous. Look what he did to Andrew Sachs, drugs and assault seem to be his way of life, not a good role model for anybody. If HE's in a film I switch it over, can't stand the guy so I guess you could say there's no way I'm going to Marlow. Shaky2 added Brand should be paying Marlow to turn the lights on. If I had my way he would never be heard of again can't stand him, an agenda bender added well done to Marlow Town Council for making sure many families won't be joining what normally is a really fun event. Alistair Gibbs said he is disgusted at the plan for Mr. Brand to perform the annual ceremony in the town pictured putting his chemical issues aside, what he purposely did to Andrew Sachs is so past the pale it beggars belief they've brought this moppet in. However, Claire McCorkle was pleased with the council's decision and wrote fantastic choice yes he had a bad past but here's proof you can turn your life around. Rebecca Francis wrote so exciting, can't wait and Catherine Mallinson said brilliant, looking forward to it. Celebrities are usually paid a fee, often more than £2,000, to switch on Christmas lights, though it's not clear what Marlowe taxpayers will be paying Mr. Brand. But if reports in April last year are to be believed, HES not likely to need the switch on fee, the reports said the anti-capitalist star planned a luxury swimming pool and home cinema at a £3.3 million thatched cottage he had purchased near Windsor Castle and was spending £1 million on renovations.